Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play FE11 Hard 5, Marth and Generics Only. In this one we're going to take on Chapter 21, Class and Clash in Makadun. So first we have some new units, uh, Sawyer, actually first it's Justinian, the Bishop, because we don't have enough Bishops, right? Sawyer the Horseman, uh, decent enough stats, we'll take it. Unel the Sorcerer, because we don't have enough magic classes, right? And then Dua the General. But yeah, now, uh, we have... N let's count, let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine magic classes. Why? I don't know. But it doesn't really matter. Oh, hi, Melodus. Thank you. Okay, this map. <clears throat> That's not super hard. Let's look at this uh, bootleg Camus with his forged javelin, but similar stats. This is a very whatever map. It's not a big deal, one way or the other. Although, you do have to deal with flyers at the beginning. Which are pretty annoying, honestly. So really, we're just going to... ...move back with these guys. And then our super general can just kinda... ...take the abuse here. He's pretty strong. I guess we're gonna send everybody over to the left. Probably a wise decision. I don't remember who all moves from the get-go. It might just be the Flyers, but I'm not positive. Dua does not really care about Brave Lances. He's very, very bulky. Which is good. Oh, it's everybody, it seems. Er, not every. Weird. I suppose they just move in phases, then. That's fine. In fact, that's probably even better. Ah, if only I was in range, though. I could have killed that guy. Yeah, this guy should go down. No issue at all. Could even longbow him. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Get that good chip in first. And we can even use the Quabo. Easy. Ah, Mart's just out of range, really. That sucks. We can get Moon Man in range. For what it's worth. Let's see. 
We don't really want our healers in range of anybody. All five million of our healers. Marth can't quite just eat Brave Lances, but he can eat one. Yeah, we can put him right here, I guess. Oh, you want to die today, son? Oh, the double dodge. Into death. Now, as long as, uh, Dua doesn't get crit five times right now, we'll be fine. Ooh, he even dodges one. Cheeky, General. Okay, this map is way easier than it looked if everybody's gonna be stationary. Or mostly everybody. But we do have to worry about this, uh... Snipper, I suppose. All the mages. All of them. Every last one of them. And then we can silver sword them. Hey, swords. <clears throat> I suppose Octu can move in range with a hammer now. Although, will that put him in mage range? No. Yeah, definitely not. And we can silver bow this guy. Or, uh, not? What? Dog, what was that? You can't just miss those. Oh. Uh, I mean, I don't particularly care about Sawyer. I do particularly care about Dua. And also, uh, your boy. I didn't even see these two over here. I might have to reset because of that miss. Not sure. We'll see. We could warp in Excalibro and. Then he could kill a flyer. But then what? He would just die to Javelin Guy, right? I think, anyways. Let's see. Dave. He's currently getting plus one from B Tomes, so we'd have 14, 42. We'd be doing 52 damage. Fifty-two minus three. Okay, he'd actually be fine. Unless he misses, obviously. <clears throat> Which he very well could. Yeah, I don't care if, like, 
five of my nine magic users die, besides uh, Looser and Trim. What I do care about is if my one Lance user dies, or my one Axe user dies. Because those are actually key members of the team. Well, he'll get retaliated upon. What is he at? 42 plus 10, 52. You should be getting one shot. Let's move you a bit to the left with the javelin equipped. Oh ho! Thought he could. Don't hurt me, please. Nice. We're all good in that case. Get him. See what turn is it for? I think next turn more reinforcements spawn. That's something we'll have to look out for. Well, there's no need to play fast. We can take this map as slow as we need to. Which is what we'll do. Trim's almost at a tome. I uh, a staves. May as well keep on going. Could bait out one of them over here with somebody. I don't think anybody's bulky enough. Well, we could use Marth actually, so we'll do that. Tickle Marth. Wow, the double crit, dude. It's crazy. Now just don't crit me. Thank you. Bro, imagine missing a general. That's a little sad. Okay, who do you want to bait out the snipper? Probably Dua, honestly. <clears throat> Everybody else is like super scared of being crit, but not Dua. Yeah, we'll heal him with the gang. I think he'll be in range of both these guys, but that's fine. He's a bulky lad, he can take the abuse. Eh, we can just use a steel bow, I guess. Ooh! Crits. I'm glad they're uh, not on the opposite side, otherwise we'd be a bit screwed. Ooh, another one. Wow. What's even going on anymore? I don't know. Ooh, more res. Uh, even though it's not very important for you specifically. Still nice. Oh, 
Now we can silver bow him. Oh, I didn't want to give the kill to you. I wanted to heal with you, but whatever. Uh-oh, here they come. As expected. It was normal for him to get a crit. Fortifies range, it's map wide, right? Honestly, I think we'll just back off and fortify. Probably a wise decision for now, anyways. Anyways, let's get him. Take him out, Dua. Nice. The Marth chip. Let's go. Mildly scared of Dragon Pike guy, but not super. Alright, come on, hit the 69, please. Good. Free killer bow, uh, that's okay, I guess. there. Who am I going to block her with? It's just Drake. Dr Dragon Pike. Almost said Draken. Which is not really a word. Now is it? That guy's not in range. This guy's not the scariest ever. So we can block with Julius in that case. Fine. Not the biggest deal in the world. Oh, now random Cav is in the range? Oh, okay. I was expecting him to have less movement than a Dragon Rider, but whatever. Whatever, I don't really care about those two too much. Oh, you're doing literally no damage to me. Nice. Zero crit with a killer. Scary. Oh no, you broke my iron sword. 
That's so sad. How could you do this? Oh, what I don't appreciate is them hanging to the left. Because that genuinely is annoying. I guess I could trade over Excalibro, though. Or, no, I can't. That won't accomplish anything. That was only a Rider's Bane, though. <clears throat> Plus, does Excalibro one-shot him? No! What do you mean, no? It was one-shotting literally every other Draco Knight. Bruh. Okay, whatever. I don't care. A little ridiculous, but whatever. He only has 18 speed. Anthony doesn't really care about that. Why are you so far out here? Some of the enemies just lag behind and do nothing. It's confusing. Left arrows, right arrows, this guy, I suppose. Then again, calves hit like trucks for some reason. They're stronger than paladins? Excuse me? That, that doesn't make any sense at all whatsoever. Huh. Yeah, that's just. Huh. Well, anyways, he'd just do 7 times 2. But yeah, we'll go for this kill. And we can move on this guy for a true one shot. Does the claw bow one shot? I don't think it does, but it should. God dang it. Well, we can get the kill with literally anybody now. Like, uh, Sawyer. Sure. Yeah, sure. That guy does have a Rider's Bane, though, but I don't really care about Sawyer too much. You can kill him if he wants. Why is this guy so strong? He's literally a Cavalier. Not a Paladin, a Cavalier. It's a little silly. Okay, let's compare you to Draco Knights. 46 HP, 47 HP. It's like, huh? I'm very confused. Why are you so bulky for literally zero reason? Guess we're taking out the Partha. At least this guy wants to die to Excalibur, even if literally nobody else does. <clears throat> wow, even Marth doesn't one round. That's kind of crazy. Wow. Yeah, just wow. Yeah, enemy bulk sure has gotten obnoxious. I guess Martha's J chillin', as they say. I don't really care about Justinian.
Wow, well, literally one shot. Didn't even get to retaliate. What a good unit. I don't care about Sawyer either. You can die. I just care about everybody else, pretty much. Okay. Anyways, let's move this guy since it's a uh, one shot. <clears throat> Part of this guy since it's a one shot. Guess you can go here with an iron bow. Cause why not? And then Marth can bait out random Thoron man, so we can kill him next turn. Oh no! That 5, I mean 15 damage crit was truly too powerful for me to comprehend. Although now we do have a problem. A genuine problem. Ah. Gonna be annoying to deal with. We could... No, we can't just move them. I wish we could move all of our problems, but we cannot. Though we can quabo them, that would cost you your life. We can quabo this guy at least. Turn is at nine. So basically, if we're gonna win, it needs to be this turn. I mean, next turn. That's interesting. I'll take note of that. Okay, Zestu, let's do or die. Awesome, you didn't die. <clears throat> then we're gonna moo you. Awesome. Now give me my, uh... Longbow back. A 
Let's go, Hepto. Magic. Magic is everything, man. Awesome. Oh boy. Yeah, you can bait out Rider's Bane, man. One more solid hit on this guy. Nice. Go walk to get him. And then trim. Uh she might not hit though. You know what, Zestu? You do the honors. You've been with us the longest while well, tied with Trim. Ah, oh, we're one tile away. Are you actually kidding me? We're gonna have to burn warp on the last turn. Spectacular. That's great. I love that. Oh, nice miss, dude. Oh, okay, Hepto. Just go in sicko mode out of nowhere. Sure, go ahead. I mean, I guess you can get Lance Rank off of this guy, why not? <clears throat> Alright, I guess we'll just do some healing. Okay, warp on the last turn. That's kinda... We're literally one turn away. Whatever. That's whatever. I'm not mad. No. Not at all. Also, hi, Gitto. Anyways, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching, and hopefully you'll join me next time when we take on Chapter 22. Peace out.